In this unit, we will review some Latin phrases that have been assimilated into the English language. A fortiori means all the more so. The phrase is commonly used in legal arguments. For example, if a certain park authority has strict rules against people entering its lawn, it can be inferred a fortiori that children are not allowed to play near the fountain which is located inside the lawn. A posteriori means knowledge of something that depends on experience or empirical evidence. It translates to from the latter, which is the reverse of a priori. For example, the mango tree in your garden has not bloomed yet is based on a posteriori knowledge. A priori meaning knowledge of something based on experience. It translates to from the earlier, which is the reverse of a posteriori. For example, it is a priori knowledge that the mango tree in your garden bears fruit during the summer months every year. Ab initio means from the beginning. In legal terms, to enter into a contractual agreement with a minor is void ab initio, which means it is invalid from the outset of such an agreement. Ad hoc means for a specific purpose. Example, after the ragging incident, the college board announced an ad hoc meeting to set up an anti-ragging committee. Ad hominem means at the man. It is a type of logical fallacy used in arguments. For example, in a good debate, we should only attack the opinions of the opponent and not the opponent himself or herself. Attacking the opponent is known as an ad hominem attack. Ad infinitum means forever and without limit. For example, some theoretical physicists say that the universe will expand ad infinitum. Ad interim means for the meantime. Example, since the canteen is infested with pests, the administrator made ad interim eating arrangements in the auditorium. Ad lib or ad libitum means as one pleases. For example, an experienced actor can pep up a poorly written scene with her ad lib performance. Ad nauseum means to sickness and refers to something done to an excessive degree. For example, most people do not discuss politics because of the politicians ad nauseum attacks on each other. Alma mater is a term used for the college or university that a person attends or has attended. Alma mater translates to nourishing mother. Alpha and omega are the first and the last letters of the Greek alphabet. The term is used to meaning the beginning and the end of something. For example, some Christians believe that Jesus Christ is the alpha and omega of time and creation. Annus Mirabilis means a remarkable year. For capitalists, a perfect example of Annus Mirabilis is the year 1989. We saw the collapse of major communist governments across Europe. Bonafide means in good faith or genuine. For example, a college might issue a certificate stating that a person is a bona fide or genuine student of that institution. Malafide means in bad faith. Example, the girl was easily able to see through the salesman's malafide intentions. Carpe diem translates to seize the day. The term was popularized by Robin Williams' character in the movie Dead Poets Society. Causus belli means the reason for dispute or the reason for war. For example, Hitler's invasion of Poland in 1939 was a causus belli for the Second World War. Cui bono translates to good for whom. It is a term used by criminal investigators to find out who would benefit from a crime to narrow down the list of suspects. De facto translates to by deed, which refers to the existing state of affairs. For example, as per the Indian constitution, the president is the head of the state, but the prime minister is the de facto ruler. De jure translates to by law. As mentioned in the previous example, the president of India is the de jure head of the state. De profundis translates to from the depths. It is a phrase used to express the most heartfelt feelings. Example, the failed artist's de profundis autobiography is a tale of anguish, heartbreak and misery. Die gratia translates to by the grace of God. Example, a clear conscience and second judgment are some virtues I am blessed with. Die gratia. Dio gratias means thanks to God. It is a phrase commonly used in Roman Catholic liturgy. Dio volente translates to God willing, meaning something will happen if God wills it. It is similar in meaning to the Arabic phrase Inshallah.
Deus ex machina translates to a god from a machine. It is a literary device mostly employed in religious books where a seemingly difficult situation is resolved by the sudden appearance and intervention of a character, object or god himself. Ex gratia translates to out of goodness. An ex gratia amount is usually given to exiting employees who worked with an organization for a specified number of years. Sometimes the ex gratia amount might be greater than what is required by law. Ex officio translates to by virtue of position or by right of office. Example, as per the legal agreement, the managing director is the ex officio partner in the organization. In absentia translates to while not present. Example, the prince becomes the in absentia ruler whenever the king takes a vacation. In camera means in private. For example, most Nazi officials who fled to Latin American countries after the Second World War were given death sentences in absentia. In extremis means in dire straits. For example, even the meekest dog when cornered in extremis might bear its teeth on the attacker. In loco parentis means in the place of the parent. For example, the aunt or uncle of a child might be appointed the legal guardian in loco parentis. In medias res means into the middle of things. Example, the hero appears on stage in medias res in the third act of the six act play. In propria persona translates to in one's own person. In certain legal proceedings, a person must appear in court in propria persona. Representations will not be allowed. In situ means in the original place. Example, after a game of chess, the king and pawn return in situ. In toto means completely or wholly. Example, each individual is different. Therefore, the whole community should not be judged in toto. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share and subscribe. For more details, visit our website leximagic.com.